Hey guys, quick tip for you here. I get asked all the time how we haul our Bobby Garland baits in our boat. What do we put them in? How do we store these packages? How do we store our lures as we're going down the highway? I'm just sitting in my boat today on the lake. Uh, I'll give you a little tip. I do not keep my baits in the plastic bag that they come in. There's a two inch uh, Bobby Garland Sunset um, Slab Slayer. And in the package, this is how it comes off the shelf. They're a little mixed up. They've been running around the boat. I don't keep them in this package. I like keeping bulk. I like having a lot of baits. I like putting them in a Plano box and having tons, tons to, to choose from. I hate to be out in the water and not have the color I need. So one, uh, one reason people don't like putting them in, this, in these Plano boxes is that it'll lose its texture. It'll lose its feel, lose its color. A little tip for you. I've been doing this for a long, long time. A little tip for you, very inexpensive, cheap way to keep those lures looking exactly the day they came out of this package, you can keep them in bulk, is mineral oil. That's right, less than $2, mineral oil. Uh, I learned this from George Tolson, a famous uh, lure maker down at Jean LaRue Bobby Garland. You can use worm oil, you can use any kind of lure oil to make. I just get this, very inexpensive. Take the top off, it has that seal on there, just poke a little bitty hole in it. And I just open up my Plano box, right, and there's two inch slab slayer box, and I just drench it. I just pour it in each container like this, right, and let that oil go to town on those things. Close this sucker up, going down the lake at 60 miles an hour, going down the highway at 80 miles an hour. This thing will, it'll lubricate all those baits and make them um, keep the texture and the lubricant just like they did when they came out of this package. I'm very anal. I want my bobber girl and baits as soon as I take one out. If the tail's bent or it's been laying in the box funny, I don't like using it. I want it to look perfect. I want it to look like exactly the way it did when it came out of this package. So this mineral oil will keep those lures, not only the shape, the texture, and the color for years. I have boxes that are sitting in my shop at home um, that are 15 years old and those lures look exactly the way they did when they came out of the package. So there you go, a little tip for you. If you guys aren't using this, if you want to keep baits in storage, I see guys, they, they have boxes and boxes and, and all kinds of cool ways to keep these things. I like just a regular Plano box, clear so I can see what I'm grabbing. Lots of them with a little bit of mineral oil. Good fishing.